All right, my curiosity got the best of me. I was going to save these till the next time I go over there, see if they have any more of these rockets at the KG Fireworks, but I don't know when I'm going to get there. I'm thinking about next week, but I don't know. So, But my curiosity, again, I got to look inside. I want to see what's inside the head, see if that's a faux head or not. I think it is. I'm going to... Um, I'm gonna bust into these things. They um oh yeah, I wanted to get this video done before uh National Fireworks Day happens. So and get this video out on uh YouTube. So here we go. Alright, everything below that head looks to be about the size of the Texas Pop Rockets, the TPRs that uh that windmill does, but uh and in and, and every respect these pretty much sound like it when they're going off they have that same that same howl I don't really call them, want to call them a whistle but you can it's more of a howl or getting getting there anyway uh, let's get a close look at that uh, there's nothing more on there all right let's go inside it's a little plastic cap no, uh, you don't need that at all. It's just pretty. But yeah, this looks like a windmill Texas pop rocket. Yeah, I just took them all off. They're just, uh, oh, they're not even glued on. They're pressure fitted. That's it. So my point is, is if you see these rockets or the windmill TPRs, either one of them, whatever whatever one you can get your hands on, get them because they're good. They are. The windmills are the best Texas Pop Rockets I've ran across so far. And uh, and these seem to be the um, illegitimate sun. I don't know what you call them, but anyway. No, they're cool. They're just as cool. These are badass. Happy National Fireworks Day, y'all pyros.